keep going. Okay. So I just got running to you from Birch, right? No, we get so all right. Well, welcome back. Yeah, it's been a hot minute. Okay, so we're we just got our running shoes from my mother. <laughs> what the fuck did you just do? <laughs> we got, Are you having a stroke? We got all right. Look, 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 look. All right, we got. We just got some running shoes. We got running shoes from our mom, and we got pokeballs from. <laughs> you know Nate? who really fucking needs running shoes? Who? That fat kid below the bottom the of the screen. The one down here? Right there. This little fat guy? What's, What's his he name? Say? If you use a PC, you can store eyes of Pokemon. Power of Science is We all know he uses his PC a lot. Oh, I bet. Because he never leaves the house. You're right. All right, so. Uh, I think and P- the PC in this game, I think, counts as either Pokemon Center or Pokemon Computer. Which is weird. And you want a Zigzagoon, what? right? Okay. So we're gonna try and find a zigzagoon. I think, yeah. So in, oh, in yeah, this yeah. route, they've That's got that groundhog. Thing. That that yes! zigzagoon. There he is. It's like a squirrel level and a, level and a badger. We'll tackle him. And a, hopefully that can kill him. A skunk all together. All right. It's amazing. I'm gonna zigzagoon. I'm gonna tackle him again. Zigzagoon. That, unless we get okay, that's perfect. All right, now we're gonna throw we're gonna throw a good old poker ball at him. And see how that goes. Oh, are you kidding me? His orange. Do we have <laughs> pokeballs now? Yeah, we we got pokeballs. I think we might die though. Oh no, she they just growled at me. Okay, oh so God. we're gonna use we're gonna use one more tackle. He had an orange berry on, so that was like really lucky too. Okay. Oh, good. we're good. Okay. We got this. Look at this. Pokeball. We're gonna throw this Pokeball at the Zigzagoon. We're gonna catch him. What do you what do you wanna name him? Oh man. It's a boy, so what do you want I'm so bad with names. Damn it. Let's just stick with the Harry Potter thing. Let's go Neville. Neville? Yeah, my second favorite character. Okay, cool. Tiny raccoon Pokemon. Favorite character is uh. This Pokemon played dead to full foes in battle. Okay. Favorite character in Harry Potter. Was yeah. Neville Neville Longbottom? No, that was my second favorite character. So you know, Lion yeah. Noon, it, it So his evolution is called Lion Noon. Like L I N L O N. If that if that changes your decision. No. What you you don't think that was a good decision? No. To stick with the Harry Potter thing. Neville Longbottom. I watched so much Harry Potter. I'm sure you did. I'm sure that I, I guess that's how you spell Neville. Once we get done with all the Harry Potter, we're going with all the new girl names. Okay. I just I don't remember binge any watching New Girl. Like I watched I watched like two episodes with you and then the problem I would do Game of Thrones except they're all so fucking long. There's no way. Yeah, you're right. All right, so oh yeah, you don't you about you know about the Pokemon Center, right? It's pretty easy. You just go in. Yeah, you, I've you I've seen. Yeah, talk to the lady and she mm-hmm. she kills your Pokemon. And yeah, she's I like, we'll help you see you again, that. but you're like, why would you the want one that? One thing I remember is the running shoes and. Pokemon Center, so. Okay, good. Well, now we, now That's you're, two things. it's I'm all sorry. new to you. All right, so we're in Route 102. Am I like 11 yet? When's my birthday? When's your birthday? In here. Do we oh, have, I don't do we know. Ever, we don't ever grow up, do we? I know, no, you, you, they didn't have enough money to put enough sprites in there. Okay, so here's our first, like, huh. regular trainer, right? He's gonna be like, <laughs> you had to bat at me now, so. What a douche, fighting a 10-year-old kid. A lot, I mean, he's, like, younger than us. I mean, look at him. Oh, never mind. He's like eight years old. Yeah. Well, well, see, what bothers me is that like you're ten and you didn't get to have a Pokemon until just now, and you've got these like six year olds. Yeah, but like super trainers, right? My dad also put me in the back of a moving truck. So I guess, yeah, yeah. We, didn't really do a lot for me. We didn't have a whole lot going for us in the beginning, anyway, did we? He wasn't like the best father. I guess you're right. I wouldn't put my son in the back of a moving truck. I'm sure that's true. I'd make my wife get back there. Oh, uh, well, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Literally, like, half the beginning of this game is just repeatedly pressing A to press tackle. Until you, like, yeah, get a bunch seems, of different Pokemon that have really good moves. Somewhat repetitive. It is so, like, it's... It gets to a point where it's not necessarily repetitive, but it's, like... So we have a doing. level... We have a level 5 zigzagoon that was the kids and then we beat him and now right. he's gonna give us money and we stomped that bitch but like the other one that was like level two had that berry that orange berry that orange berry re- re- i wonder if he still has it let's, up. let's see if he still has it nah he used it and now we, now i hate him uh so the or- what is the orange berry exactly so an orange berry is it's, it's a berry it uh it re- <laughs> oh no shit it replenishes Sherlock. i think it's 10 hp so like if you eat it in battle It'll each, so you can oh, either okay. you can either use it as an item or you can give it to the Pokemon as a held item. If right. he uses that a held, if he uses it as a held item, then it, it will it will 
it will randomly use it in battle and you won't have to use it as a turn. So okay. like going to your bag and using something counts as a turn. Okay. Fighting, use a turn. Going to Pokemon, switching Pokemon, it counts as a turn. Oh, okay. So it's, it's a turn. It's turn-based combat. So. I got gotcha. you. But I think Mud Slap might be pretty good. Yeah, that's. I guess that's do more damage. And it, it took like over a quarter off. It lowers his accuracy, which is helpful. So that means he can't hit me as often. <laughs> Mud Slap. So you've got so many different stats. You've got like attack, defense, special attack, special defense, HP, speed, accuracy. I think that's it. I could be, I'm probably super wrong. I feel like there's plenty more. I used to do all these like IV training, or IV breeding and then EV training stuff that you know nothing about. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I have no idea. What yeah, so. <clears throat> I'm so lost. I'll, we'll, we'll have a little lesson today, so. I feel like I need to be taking notes. You probably do. So, IV training. Let's get lost in the world. Of Pokemon. Yeah. So, Ooh. IV breeding, I mean. So you basically, you take a Pokemon, right? You want that Pokemon to be as best as it can possibly be, right? And so the way to do that is okay. you, you breed it to perfection. Oh, nice. You like, you put it in the daycare with a super good ditto. And then like, you give it some items to make him keep those certain, certain levels. And IV is called like an individual value. Sexy time for your Pokemon. Yeah, your Pokemon, they go in there, they do the dirty, and then they... They come out with a with an egg, and you hatch the egg, and hopefully that 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 egg baby comes out super awesome. Damn, and I'm like the I'm like the best matchmaker on the planet too. So like, so you'd be perfect for this. I'm perfect. I'm this is literally my jam. I know. And so, I, except you know, the problem is waiting. I, I waited till I was 19 to even like play Pokemon. So, yeah. and so the way you do this is where was my childhood? I don't really know. Well, yeah, you just. I will admit, my father did not put me in the back of a moving truck. Well, that's good. But I also never had the opportunity to play Pokemon. Like, well, I had the opportunity, but not I think my, my extensively, dad. such as yourself. Yeah, yeah. I think my dad, he bought me a Game Boy when I was, like, five. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember, because he bought it for me when I was five, like, right before I went to kindergarten. Mm -hmm. He was like, all right, Evan, this is the most expensive thing that I will ever buy for <laughs> you. Little did he know you were going to go to college. Little did he know. <laughs> That Damn. I'm now in college. Whoa. Th that one had an Orenberry too. We just okay. You but 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 at five no, years no, old, no. being told that something was super expensive and now it was mine, it was mine. Oh, it's just yeah, it's just. And so yeah. Super. And then like uplifting, I guess. And so I just played Pokemon and I didn't understand it all too well, but I still played it and I liked it a lot. So I think that's why I kept playing it. And then I I started to understand what was going on. And then I started to get into really a whole lot of video games. And then my life spiraled down. What, wait, wait, where? Is that when your life spiraled out of, I get, spiraled I, out of control? I'm trying to find the point in which that started happening. Um, okay, so now we got orange berries. Not long ago. Hey, look, we got orange berries now. We can give them to our Pokemon. Hey, nice. And these are Pecha berries. I think they cure poison? I could be wrong. We'll check it. So, oh yeah, that's like a status effect. So they got status effects. You got poison. You got... Uh, like electric, like uh, us, that's static. Did I say static? Yeah, you said static. So static is like you, you're paralyzed, you can't move. Okay. You got poison, you got confusion, so you can be confused, and right. like it'll be like, oh, this Pokemon's confused, and then it'll say, oh, it hurt itself in its confusion, and it just like destroys you and makes you so mad. And then there's like frozen and burned now. I, I don't know what they had in this game. So Petchberry, he kills poison. I was right. Then the Orenberry, we're gonna give this Orenberry to George. And we're gonna give the other one to Hell Neville. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even check that. We're just gonna, George is gonna be like badass. So we're gonna we're gonna train up Neville a little bit. Does that sound good to you? Yeah. Sure. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna do a thing called switch battling. So you go in with your super low level Pokemon, run around a little bit, get a get a battle to commence. So here you are okay. with this so Pokemon. At least it's not the. Uh... Yeah, yeah. So then you go to your Pokemon. That dog. You go over to George. Patrick. Come up. What's in the jacket? I'm trying to figure out what this thing looks like. So Oops. you got you got George. He's here. Welcome, George, to the party. Uh, we're gonna use tackle because I don't think ground types are effective with bug type. Oh, that'll work. We're gonna hit him in two, two hits. Oh, nice. Yeah, dead. Bam. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that thing Neville gained 11 experience points. 
Yeah, low level Pokemon, it's kind of stupid to battle with those. So we're going to go to this trainer. She's going to battle us. Then we'll switch battle that way. And then we'll be good. Okay. See, a thing that I liked, but it also made a lot of the games easier, was the introduction of the EXP share. So the experience share, basically what it does is it gives the the holder um, extra the XP of the battle, even if it wasn't in the battle. Mm -hmm. uh, that's how it used to be until Generation 6, which was X and Y. Mm -hmm. And they would give it to you at like the very beginning of the game X and Y. Right. And what and it, instead, this time, it was just a key item, and you would switch it on or off, like a friggin' light switch. And when you switched it on, it literally gave experience to every single Pokemon in your party. So you could go with just one Pokemon the entire time, at, from like level five until whatever and just catch a bunch of Pokemon and never use them and by the time you got to the Elite Four they'd all be like level 50 and 60 oh, so which it, it, which is cool but at the same time it I feel like it lowers the difficulty level to a point you know yeah well then yeah does that make sense to you? I, yeah it, it does all right so I mean it's sweet. like so much information but yeah I'm literally learning a new language right now so we're gonna switch back into Neville I learned French in like fifth grade. Good job. I didn't. Sixth grade. I went to France. Did you go to France? I didn't go to France. Well, I, we should have. You I got farther gone. than I did. Let's just say that. Let's put it that way. France is pretty cool. I like France a lot. You been to France? No, I just said <laughs> I've never been to France. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. You can ask me like a bunch of times. Probably the only thing. The only good hey. part about the beginning of this <laughs> game is the world <laughs> building. Have you gone to Salt Lake City? Yeah. Shit. I've been to the airport. Huh. Have you gone to... San Francisco? No, I actually haven't. Ha <laughs> ha! You've been to San Francisco, haven't you, buddy? I was only in the airport, yeah, on the way back from there. I've got, I've got some Palm cousins. Spring. I've got some cousins who live in San Francisco. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. My sister went over there one time. See, my cousin is in Palm Springs, so we went and visited our cousin in Palm Springs. That's good. Hey, look at George. And we like drove over to LA. Uh huh. It's like an hour. Yeah, yeah Palm Springs not far. Like an hour and a half. Or yeah, something. yeah. I know what you mean. I we, was. We drove. Yeah, we just went to Santa Monica Pier. And got lost, and my phone died, and I was like lost on Santa Monica oh, here for like an hour. It was kind of a, kind of a sticky situation, mm -hmm. you know. And I was really scared, and I couldn't find my mother. Mm -hmm. And it was, it was, you know, last summer was not a good summer for me. You just couldn't find your. What, was your mom even on that trip with you? No, it was my granddad. Oh, that's my grandmother. Bad. She couldn't go to Santa. Oh, she was freaking out. That's too bad. Okay, okay. And okay, then okay. we uh, went over back to Palm Springs and. When we, when we went back, we flew from Palm Springs to uh, San Francisco. San Francisco, Salt Lake, Salt Lake, Delaware, and then to, yeah. To Jackson. <clears throat> yeah, Jackson. All right. And drove back. Okay, so this this is our dad's gym, right? This is our dad. Huh. Finally in the picture, huh? Yeah. yeah. So Wait until the second episode this, to show your face. This is actually the first Pokemon game where you actually Ball, have a fat dad. fat motherfucker. What? This was the first Pokemon game where you actually had a dad. Oh, yeah. shit. Yeah, like all the other ones, you don't know where your dad is. Yeah. And there's like a whole lot of like, uh, like conspiracy theories that like there was like a great Pokemon war, and like yeah. everyone's dad went and died in the war. That's crazy talk. Why would so, you? But we don't know what that is. That means. All right, so we got we got Wally here. I don't know what's wrong with Wally. I think he has cancer. Because what? like, I think something's wrong. Like he has a terminal illness that I'm pretty sure is what's going on. He's like super skinny, and like. You, you got to take care of him, even though he's like your saint, the same age as you, and you yeah. just got your freaking Pokemon, right? So like you're like, what? What does this mean? Why do I have to take care of this kid? Yeah, you're like, and like I'm you, too good for this kid. Like Get he's like staying with his uncle here. and stuff for a while, and like then he goes back to his parents' house. So I don't know. I don't know what's going on. And but, now I feel bad. But he, I feel bad for complaining about my dad. Now. No, but he becomes like a super strong trainer or whatever. Really? But you still beat him because that's just how the game works. Is you literally have to beat everyone. Oh yeah, well, makes um, sense. Gotta so, catch them all, right? Yeah, so he gets a pretty cool Pokemon. His first Pokemon is a Ralts. Right. Ralts. I call it Ralts. That's how I've called it since I was five years old, so fight me. Uh, Ralts. That's not ours. Ralts. That, that's your dad's Exigoon that he's using, by the way. So we got Alien. Yeah, yeah. So it's, Ralts is a pretty cool Pokemon. Uh, it evolves into Gardevoir, which is a really good psychic type. Um, but I think around Gen, I think Gen Four, Generation Four, is when it when it was able to evolve into a different Pokemon, 
called Gallade, uh, which mm-hmm. is like a fighting psychic type, which I liked a lot okay. better. But then they all got Mega Evolutions in Generation Six, so there you go. Are you looking at pictures of Gallade? No, I was. I was. There's a okay. So there was a character from Looney Tunes that reminded me of, and it was Marvin the Martian. Ah. Uh, and I couldn't remember oh, the name. Yeah, 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 Save Marvin. my fucking life. That's right. So I was looking up. <laughs> I was looking up Alien Looney Tunes Looney characters. Tunes. Gosh. <laughs> Okay, so he so t- if you want to get a Ralts, we can catch a Ralts, but you don't seem to be too interested in Ralts. No. Okay. Uh, it looks like a, a no. Okay. I never liked Marvin the Martian. Okay. It's too sneaky. Show your face, Marvin. Right. Like, so come his, on. His mom's waiting for him, so he has to go. He's wearing. I think he has a chemo appointment or something. <laughs> chemo appointment. There's cancer in Pokemon. Oh my I'm almost po- I I feel like that. I I don't know what made me think that at some point. But I mean, I'm pretty sure that's the case. So far, I'm. I'm collected, in. and I'm I'm in, but like, your dad sucks. Uh-huh. Your, your best friend right now has got cancer. Uh-huh. It's it's a little it's a little depressing it at is. the same time. Yeah, I guess you're right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. I I'm training to be really good at this stuff. There you go. But my best friend's got cancer. He's uh-huh. gonna die. Yeah, I guess you're right. He's gonna right. get really really good. Yeah. He's gonna fucking die. Yeah. That's sad, man. I know. It All makes right. me sad. We're going to go Popsicle. All right. It makes we're, me sad. We're going to go Popsicle. We're going to stop the episode, and we'll come back. We'll go back. We'll do, like, one or two more episodes, and then we'll, we'll do something else.